Okay, they're kind of... Yes, I know I'm in a Lamborghini and I'm their rifle, but come on. Shika Hogan here reporting for the festival. So, unexpectedly, I'm making a video on the non automotive day of my schedule in this channel just for my birthday because I want it to be a little special. And well, I feel like this game is perfect to make a dream come true, right? So, well, mostly. I mean, this Subaru alone is pretty much my one of my dream car <laughs> because it looks so normal, especially at this time. Well, at that at its time. So you know, today is my birthday, 31st of October, which is also a spooktober. But I'm not gonna do a Halloween stuff because everybody else already doing it. I mean, I could throw a Mustang and put blood finial all over the place, but <laughs> That's, you know, a bit overboard. But anyway, today is my birthday and realistically speaking, I don't expect too much in real life, to be honest. I mean, well, I could expect something, but it's not gonna be a car or a new console or something. I mean, I'm way too old for that. I mean, not really way too old in terms of playing it, but, you know, I'm already 21. Okay. So, today we're gonna find a car that I want to buy, if possible, but, well, I actually can buy on this game, so that's beside the point, but we're gonna change the year, so, okay, apparently they have the two 2550s, <laughs> oh, wow, okay, so that's beside the point, so I feel like, you know, if I want a car for my birthday, I want something that's really special. Something that kind of, you know, I will like, but I the one that I really specifically I aim in real life, actually, is something that came from the 90s. To be more precise, the same year as I born. So that will be 1997. So we have, of course, 1999 cars like so. But this is where the fun began. We from the skyline here to the M3. I mean, I could go cheap <laughs> with that. So we have a bunch of options here, like the GTR V spec here. Uh, this is the R32, I think. The A the A50 R Volvo, also from the 1997. Lamborghini Diablo Super Veloce. Which is also from 1997. F1 GT. I kind of tempted to buy this, but my god, that's really expensive to be honest. <laughs> RX7. Yeah, this is a bit overused, but and I, well, I do like the car, but not to the personal level as I want to buy it. No, no, that's not it. And there is a Type R. I. I kind of want to, but <laughs> it's a Type R man, you know that stuff. There is the M3. This is the E36, I think. I think this is the E36 M3. Yeah, it looks similar to the one that Alex owned from the car portal, obviously. Uh, Land, Def Land Rover Defender. Uh, it's cool, but. I'm gonna have to go with the Lamborghini Diablo Super Veloce. So, I decided the car, Lamborghini Diablo, but I'm not gonna buy that, I'm gonna buy yours. That's more realistic to me <laughs> in real life, but still, it's a Lamborghini, goddammit, it's pretty expensive. This is upgraded to S2, uh, it's... Why you put the pink on the bloody Lam Diablo? Bloody hell! <laughs> why? Don't do that! You make me sad! <laughs> okay, are there any more expensive than 96? I want to just buy it out. I mean, I could try to bid, but... Uh, bidding took take some time. So, okay, what's this? Mm, nope. Uh, sure, the paint is cool, but 
it's not rap. <laughs> Everything has to be right when I have to get the car. Obviously, I mean, well, buying US is asking too much if I, you want a specific color. <laughs> but, but, yeah. Looks like there are no more than, well, there are no less than 96,000, so. Looks like the lucky guy is here, the Anar Changeless from Hoku Club. I'm gonna buy your car in your full asking price. I mean, sure, you, you have to check things here and there before you buy, but eh, this is game. Everything will be perfect. Even the most unreliable car is... Mm, I forgot to... Uh, I forgot what's the most unreliable car, to be honest. <laughs> but one one car that really unreliable is pretty much reliable on this game, so it will be fine. So this is an A class stock, which is pretty cool, and I got disconnected, obviously. So Mike, thanks for the car, man. I'm gonna put it into a good use. So Mike, let's go to my garage, jump onto the Lamborghini section which is here actually uh, yeah this adds more <laughs> Lamborghini collection to my garage which is that's it actually I don't want to buy more Lamborghini at this point to be honest because the other Lamborghini is uh, you know it's it's not bad but I just don't like it so like, let's go to the upgrade maybe uh, you know what, before that, I'm gonna drive it stock first around the city a little and see how it feels. Oh, it spins the wheel. <laughs> it spins the wheel. But how about proper launch? I can't even do proper launch with the rear wheel drive. This is a rear wheel drive car, which is. Yeah, pretty cool. <laughs> and pretty heavy too. But it's fine. This car is pretty cool. I mean, with all those mid-engine stuff there and it's pretty fast for an old car this car eh, it's pretty nice actually to run around I mean it's not bad like you know braking still need, need tech sometimes a little and it doesn't real spin because the power is just right for a stop I mean that's always the case for a car like this. Yeah, car will still turn. That's good. I wonder what option we have for this car. Maybe not much because... I don't know. I mean, I hope they have some option for the body kit from the Lamborghini itself. Because... The foot on top... Well, the scoop on top is cool, but... I want something that on the side maybe, you know? Maybe there is, maybe not. So yeah, let's take a look on what option we have for this car. Shall we? Okay, upgrades and tuning. There is nobody get presets. But let's check on this first. We have only transmission swap and aspiration swap. Aspiration, it's naturally aspirated. Wow, that's cool. <laughs> Man, this car is actually a natural aspirated car. I didn't expect that. <laughs> oh, okay. No wonder it launched kind of nice, actually. Let's see the option. Yeah, of course. The Forza stuff. Uh, come on. It can be better. I mean, come on. I mean, sure, the bigger wing is better for the visibility, actually. No, it doesn't make much difference. It, it's still... A small window <laughs> okay but we're gonna keep the body kit as is give the race tire and that's already jumped the car to 133 <laughs> wow okay oh the tire is already pretty huge stock 235 the bigger one is 245 not too big not as big as Subaru actually that's interesting Three, oh the rear is actually very big it's already 335 stock and then 345 an addition of 10 millimeters so wheel spacer uh, give mm, that's outside actually <laughs> yeah 
yeah, I don't want to put the wheel on the outside, obviously. So let's keep it as that. The rear, uh, yeah, that's still too wide. Oh, there is a Forza tone. I don't join that for now. I'm not gonna join that. So drive plane, let's do that. I'm gonna keep it rear wheel drive because. Uh, it's as if I don't have enough car for S1 with rear-wheel drive. <laughs> Actually, I don't even have enough car for all-wheel drive car for the S1 class. <laughs> oh boy. Give it some brakes. Some... Race spring? Yeah, that's good. Extra roll bar for extra stability. Uh, roll cage? Yeah, nah. I don't need that. I mean... That at... 200 pound that's too much like reduction oh okay 200 and 2815 hmm this is pretty good I don't have to do much modification for the engine actually that's nice so let's see camshaft yeah <laughs> yes more power for me ah, more power for you where Okay, I'm gonna put on the flywheel first in case I forgot. Uh, what else? Uh, displacement. Oh yeah, six thousand. Nice, 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 nice. How about you? Oh, that's good. We could use some more weight reduction. More weight reduction. <laughs> of course, I really love weight reduction, man. <laughs> okay, that doesn't reduce the weight actually. Yeah, that's disappointing. Even more weight reduction. Even more weight reduction. <laughs> okay, that's too much actually. Okay. Ah, uh, this is fine. Right. We make six hundred and eighty-four horsepower with the weight of two thousand seven hundred and six pound and uh, torque of five hundred forty-three feet per pound. I think that's how you pronounce it. And displacement of 6. So 0 to 60, 3.9 seconds. Slower because this is, well, rear wheel drive. Top speed is 226.4, which is actually really, which is also slower than my Subaru. Oh, what, what the hell is wrong? Oh no! I made Lamborghini slower than. Oh, <laughs> it's fine though. Uh, yeah, that's pretty nice. Uh, and the upgrade cost is only cost me 58,000. I mean, well, I only make it for S1 class, so it's fine. Not much additional power, but it has a lot less weight, that's for sure. So it already has the car mastery for. The Daredevil and the Wombo combo, so this is a uh, race pack, maybe? No, I think this might be a uh, drag. Mm, yeah, maybe this is the drag car build, maybe. I don't know. So let's change the paint. I'm not gonna do something too complex for this video, but I will do it later if I really like the car. So, oh wow, it has a lot of manufacturer color. Oh, the red is so good. Oh my god, the red is so good. Oh, the orange. Oh my god, this is so beautiful. The orange is so beautiful, but I prefer red. Uh, what else? Oh, wow. Okay, 90s car has the most interesting color choice, to be honest. Oh, black. Eh, it's boring. Silver, it's boring. White, it's good. This one is good. So I bet I'm gonna pick red. Because red means three times faster. Oh, that's a nice kind of power delivery. I really like that. And it turns. Turns really nicely. Doesn't understeer. Let's see how, what it captures here. Oh, a bit jump there, but it's fine. Oh, I really love this car. This car is so good. What if there's it a delivery for this car? <laughs> Maybe I should search for that and show it to you at the very end of the video because why the hell not uh, okay let's try the drag race 
it won't have the best launch, obviously. And I'm expecting to be defeated by other cars. But as long as this car makes me happy, I'm really happy about it. Uh, the pop-up headlights came out really weirdly, actually. <laughs> uh, but I really love this car. It looks pretty cool. Oh, we're fighting a Carrera and a Ferrari. Oh, it's nice. That was a nice acceleration, actually, once you stop the wheel spin. Oh my god. We already finished. Oh, the Ferrari is... Uh, yeah, that was a Ferrari, right? Oh yeah, the beautiful Lamborghini. Oh, that's a Jaguar XJ220. I haven't tuned that up. I forgot about that, actually. <laughs> yeah, I forgot most of my burn fight, god damn it. And that's... The Diablo Super Fellow save. Pretty good on drag strip, actually. Huh. That is interesting. But how about... Uh, an interesting... Street race. Oh, so close. <laughs> that was so close. Oh, come on. I want to do a wheel spin. Well, maybe after this. When we finish the race. So... Yeah, let's do this again, maybe. Or, okay, we, we, I don't want to do that all for and over again. So yeah, Murhead Wind Farm. Oh, I really love this Diablo. It's such a nice car. I mean, look. Oh, yes. Oh, hello, Volkswagen. <laughs> let's do it on solo, obviously. Super retro cars, of course. This might be not the strongest car on S1, but, you know, if I like it, I'm gonna enjoy it. That's what drives me for cars, actually. If I don't enjoy it, I don't even want to touch the car. Even I I will throw it away, pretty much. In real life, actually. Oh, there is a Carrera, I think. That's a Carrera, right? Uh, yeah, it's a Carrera. I don't know what year, but it's a Carrera. Uh, well, turn is pretty much good on basic, so... Yeah, not the best launch, but it's fine. Okay, can we make a turn here? Oh! Oh, bloody hell, Ferrari! I know I like Ferrari! Oh! Oh, come! What's up with the AI? They're trying... Yes, I know I'm in a Lamborghini and I'm their rifle, but come on! They're trying to murder me! <laughs> Seriously! What's up with that? <laughs> no, I cannot catch up! <laughs> Bloody hell! <laughs> okay, I went too slow. I can go faster around there, actually. With half throttle. I'm on inside, so I need to break. Okay, the car is fairly tameable, actually. It's really nice to control. Oh! Maybe not on the dirt, it doesn't like dirt, and it doesn't like jump. Ooh, okay, sorry. And it stops. Stops really nicely. <laughs> wow. Come on, overtake the Porsche here. I don't know what Porsche that is. It has a long tail. Keep the gear. Ah, there we go. Oh, that's... I almost got the overtake. Ah, there we go. Got it. Now we got to overtake the rest of the pack on the front. Break right here. That's actually really slow. I need to put more brake pressure on it. Maybe I'll tune that. But, ah, this car is fairly controllable for an S1 rear wheel drive. I recommend this car, <laughs> but it's not that very fast, at least my driving. Oh, that Porsche is went, went really wide. Come on, block it, nice. Okay, we got 5th position, not bad. But there you go, the Super Fellow say. I really like it. Oh my god, this car is so good. 
44 second best lap not bad really in fact uh, yeah we're the fastest yeah I'm the fastest one around this circuit okay that's oh my god I cannot believe I really like this car but well I guess this is one of my dream car from when I was a child to be honest I mean it looks so unique <laughs> and well we got the wheel spin let's see what we got uh, speaking of wheel spin I think I'm gonna do something about it oh come on I don't even need another jacket I, I all I need all I need is the one that I am wearing now so yeah there you go the super fellow say Lamborghini uh, Diablo <laughs> Really love it